U.S. Navy and Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force sailors stationed around Japan came to Yokosuka to take part in a three-day bilateral non-commissioned officer leadership continuum. It is the second time the conference has been held and aims to build relationships between Japanese and U.S. sailors. Many of the challenges that we face are very similar. Many of the ways that we attack those problems are similar. Um, and so being able to come together and uh, use the best traits from both countries to get after some of these challenges uh, has been really, really remarkable. Each of the 12 U.S. sailors partnered with a JMSDF sailor to discuss a variety of topics in a group setting, such as leadership, family support, sailor resiliency, drug and alcohol programs, and women in the workplace. It taught me a new perspective on the Japanese military, um, and I'm really grateful to be selected for this class. Not everything took place in a classroom. After hours, they played softball to further build camaraderie and tour to ship from each Navy. Um, it is important that bilaterally we are a strong team together, and it is important that we use the best traits of each country to make uh, each country just that much stronger and better. And they did a remarkable job uh, coming together with good thoughts and good ideas and collective responses for both nations to work on. Naval Forces Japan plans to hold more continuums quarterly to continue fostering relationships and help our navies work together moving into the future. Reporting from Yokosuka Naval Base, I'm Petty Officer Chase Hawley.